So, just come out today, well, it's the first I've seen of it today being posted, Infinity Studios half-scale Lego Lass statue out for pre-order this weekend, this Saturday, I think, actually, which is an unusual date. But anyway, yeah, Saturday. I've never owned an Infinity piece before. I think Infinity Studios are a fantastic company. Everything they seem to have done so far has been brilliant. And from what I've read and seen of uh, reviews, it's been all received by fans with nothing but praise for the pieces. So, yeah, uh, I've, I've been sort of watching since they revealed that they were doing Lord of the Rings. And for you, those of you that don't know, this Lego Lass is one of three, potentially four pieces, actually. So that that comes up for pre-order this Saturday, the Lego Lass piece does. But there's also a half-scale Gandalf, which I'm really interested in, really interested in, excuse me. Now, when the images of that came out, a few people were sort of like, oh, well, I don't know about it. I'm not sure about the pose. I love the pose. I mean, that pose, for anyone that knows the film, they know exactly what part of the film that's from. They know exactly what's going on. They even know exactly what he's just said or is about to say from that. I think it's a striking pose. And I, I thought that it would really go well as a piece displayed next to my, my Balrog diorama. And again, this all hinges on Infinity Studios and who I can get in touch with that can ship to the UK because they can't. And obviously price. I need to think, obviously, a half scale piece. It's, you know, it, it's it's displaying it somewhere so I need to think of that as well but I'm, I'm very interested in, in, that, in that Gandalf piece and yeah some other comments were because none of us know what the price is going to be yet but it's not going to be cheap half scale Infinity Studios as well and people were saying well it's just the head and hands really and the rest of it's all mixed media oh, yeah I agree it is it, and I can understand why people are sort of a little bit down on that but you know, it's, it is what it is, and I don't know, it's what I'm very, very interested in, in seeing the Gandalf piece, it's the one that really piqued my interest, that is, however, until I saw a few days ago, and I'll put an image of it somewhere here, the Nazgul sword, now, I don't know what that is referring to, are they doing just a Nazgul sword, are they doing a Nazgul, a half-scale Nazgul, if so, wow, that date, I presume, is they're going to is where they're going to reveal what it is. Now, I'm a hundred percent up for the Nazgul sword on its own. That that would be brilliant. I'd love it. I'd be really up to see what the Nazgul piece is as well, half scale. If it is that, I don't think it'd be a Witch King of Angmar. I don't think it'll be that. I think it will be just a Nazgul. I say just a Nazgul. But yeah, I'm very very interested to see what that is. And of course, we can't leave out Infinity Studios' colossal one to one scale Sauron bust, which is actually the entire torso, two arms and the head. And on the from the measurements of it, it's 175 centimeters. It's just shy of six foot. And it is, it is absolutely huge. It is absolutely huge. Can you even begin to imagine just how much that piece is going to be? No idea what price tag that is. Do you know what? I shudder to think what the shipping alone on that would be. I mean, how many boxes is that going to come in? That is literally 175 centimetres. That has literally got to be almost the size of a full 1-1 one, one scale full body piece do you know what I mean and yeah it's it's colossal I mean I can't wait to see someone who does get it I mean the the picture that I've got obviously it looks like the guy's way short that he's not it's actually set up on a on a table that is but it, it is 175 centimeters that is so yeah man Infinity Studios brilliant brilliant stuff by them I'm really quite interested to see what's what's going to happen this weekend, what reveals they've got, or the price on the Legolas piece. Am I going to pre-order it at the moment, guys? I'll be honest, I'm I'm really torn. I'm in real, two minds. It'll be dependent on price. It'll be dependent on where I think I'm going to display it. 
because something like that, you know, it's it really deserves displaying, which might I would might have to consider maybe getting rid of my terminator piece, which I really don't want to do. I really don't want to do. So yeah, I've got some thinking to do, but again, wait till wait till this weekend. So that's all it was, guys. Uh, just wanted to share with you the, the amazing stuff by Infinity Studios, really. And have any of you been looking at this stuff? Are you aware of it? And if you're thinking of getting it, uh, have any of the pieces coming? Jesus, if you're thinking of getting the Sauron life-size bus, please, please message me and let me know where on earth you, you're going to put it. And uh, Christ, because that, that thing looks in, incredible. Absolutely incredible. I mean, that's a 0% from me. Because I literally have nowhere to put it, and I doubt very much I would be able to afford it. Because I, I, I just don't think what the price on that would be. Yeah, so that's it, guys. So uh, hoping to do a video this weekend. So that's coming up. Uh, I've got a haunt chat coming up. I've got a couple of other videos I've got to do coming up as well. But this will be in the next couple of weeks. So once again, thank you everybody for watching this. Really appreciate it, especially. You guys who are, who are watching and commenting and subscribing, I can't thank you enough. If you're not doing any of those things, please can you do them because the subscriptions really help, liking really helps and commenting, I promise I'll get back to each and every one of you. Any questions, please ask. Anything you want bringing up, just, just again ask me to bring it up and I'll bring it up in the next video or the next chat. And thank you all very much and have a lovely evening and I'll catch you all on the next one. Ta-ra! Thank you.